My name is Osura Choa, but people know me as Josh, and I come from Pasco, Washington. So I um, grew up in a Christian background. Um, I went to church all my life, but I really never knew God. I just heard about him, and people just told me about him. But I really not got, never got that deep connection. And then um, I just started to go to church daily as a kid. Middle school hit, and that's when things kind of hit rock bottom, or not really rock bottom, but started to change in my life, you know? The party life started to get into it. You know, lust and girls started to, you know, come into the picture, and it just was really, um, overwhelming at first, but um, the, I just started to like it more and more as soon as I got into it. And you know, I just, every day, every day, you know, what are we gonna do next? How are we gonna get drunk? How are we gonna go smoke, you know? Girls would always hit me up, you know, what do you wanna do, and this and that. And it just got kind of to the point where this is my life now and I had to make a decision. So then freshman year hit, and I had completely just dropped the Christian lifestyle, you know? God was the least thing on my mind. It was pretty much of, you know, what am I gonna do tomorrow? Or, you know, what are my, you know, what are my friends are gonna do tomorrow? And what am I gonna do with them? And it just got to the point where depression started to kick in, where, you know, I was always that guy that seemed happy, but deep down inside, I was really hurt and just depressed, and I didn't know what to do with myself, so I just, you know, started reverting and getting more heavier into the party life and with lust. And then one day, Jacob was coming over at my house and he invited me to home group. And at first, my initial reaction was, you know, I don't really want to go, but you know, he was very persistent, you know, always told me, you know, oh, man, come on, it'll, it'll be fun. So then um, I decided to go and then it was pretty fun. So then the next following week, I go to the Wednesday service. And then um, I, that's the day I get my life to Christ. And it was honestly just the best feeling in the world. I couldn't imagine the, just the love and the, and the happiness that God gave to me. So then um, Pastor Joey comes to one special service. And honestly, at that point, I was just astonished and amazed at what God can do to me and what he can, I can do to others. So then that's when I fully, you know, just gave my life to Christ. That's when, you know, I was like, you know what, God, I'm going to give my life and I'm going to be dedicated to you. And so today I want to get baptized is because I want to make that final statement about me being a Christian, you know, me wanting to, you know, just serve God in everything and anything he can do with me. Um, I'm Josue Ochoa, and this is my testimony. Josh, do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's Son and your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. Do you promise to follow Him with good and clear conscience for the rest of your life? Yes. Based on your faith, confession, and your commitment, we'll baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.